Uh, we started off good in the first half. We were fighting some miscues here and there, offense and defense. But I mean, I think we just everybody knows we're down guys. It's tough to play seven guys as much as, we, as we've been playing, and uh, we just kind of lost it, lost focus some parts of the game. Going forward, what would you guys take away? Um, that we just need to keep playing hard. And, you know, we gotta we gotta keep fighting. You know. We're not gonna just get handed wins, and even though we're down, we still got to be able to execute and finish off game plans to win games. Did you guys have anything? Your goal that's not working. <laughs> uh, just overall thoughts on the game, coach. Uh, you know, we we looked uh, we looked like a tired, depleted team today, um, and uh, you know, I mean, in some ways, I can't uh, I can't blame our guys. You know, I mean, it, obviously, we we've, we've got hit with a. A little bit of an injury bug. Um, a lot of guys are out, um, and so uh, you know we, we, we we're, we're playing with guys a lot of minutes, and uh, we played them a lot of minutes on uh, on Thursday, and you know you kind of combine that. Uh, you know our freshmen looked like freshmen. Second half, I thought we had a couple of good spurts to try to get back in the game, and we we might have missed. I lost count at about six point blank layups. That if you're a college basketball player, you got to be able to make, and, and we missed all of them. Three front ends of one on ones. Um, you know, we, we we go nine of fifteen from the free throw line, um, and I, I dare say that uh, you know a number of those misses were front ends. Um, you know, I mean, it, it makes it difficult to be able to win. Um, so, you know, and it's it, it it's a little hard. I mean, you know, our goal this year was we were going to try to make the conference tournament. You know, we we we've certainly at times played well enough to do that. Um, you know, and I mean, this this was this was a must-win game, um, and maybe a little bit because of youth, and maybe having people really figure out how to, how it's done, how you got to be able to get to that point. You know, we um, we we didn't we didn't play today with a sense of urgency you need in order to be able to win that game. I mean, and 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 again, I hope I hope that that what we learn from it. I hope that we uh, we get ourselves in a position that we really. You know, for next year, it's kind of what I told them in the locker room. You know, I mean, it's this was an elimination game, and, and you know, you're always, you're going to have one of those at some point in your career, no matter if, unless you're the national champion. You know, um, how in the world are you going to you know react to it and build yourself for where we got to go from here? Um, that's a pretty good answer, to Jordan. For us, you just talk about his play a little bit. Jordan's been great. I mean, he's. <laughs> I mean, I I don't, I don't even know what to ask more out of the kid. You know, I mean. I mean, I don't mean to politic, but you know, if he's if he's not freshman of the year this year, there's something wrong. Um, you know, I mean, the kid the kid played 40 minutes last night on Thursday. We had him come back, and he's got to play 40 again tonight. Um, you know, I mean, he's 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 doing everything that we ask of him. I mean, he's gonna he's a good player already. He's gonna be a really good player. Um, so, you know, those are the positive parts of it. But you know, we we, we didn't we didn't get enough stuff around him today. That's for sure.